Hey guys, it's Daniel Funky from the International Fact Checking Network at Pointer. On today's episode of Check It, we're talking about how to make fact checks into GIFs and why everybody should be trying to incorporate these into their workflow. So in 2016, Cheque Ado, an Argentinian fact-checking organization, started to use GIFs to expand its audience. To do that, it partnered with the website Uno to make one fact-check a week into a GIF. Here's more from Editorial Innovation Director Pablo Martín Fernández. You get to a lot of people in social media that maybe are not uh, going to click and go to the, the complete article. So what we thought is what we can, what we could do to um, I don't know, to augment the experience that people have in social media with us. And not, not only having the headline and the, and the ratings, but also having a brief explanation about why we choose that uh, rating. And that's where GIFs uh, enter this environment, because it's really easy to create uh, a piece uh, and make it um, shareable. Why should fact checkers use GIFs? Turns out adding a little humor to your news coverage really helps your audience. That's all for now. You can try using GIFs in your own newsroom using Uno or another service like Giphy. Tune in next month for another two-minute tutorial to help make you a better fact checker. Until next time, I'm Daniel Funky.